for any Christians out there, I have a couple of questions. The whole thing with eternal punishment in hell. Did God create hell or did Satan? If Satan did, then, and if it's, you know, against God's will, then can he just prevent it? I mean, did he actually give someone who works for him so much power that, you know, they could make something that he couldn't undo? If it was God, then where did that infinite mercy go? Shouldn't God have foreseen that Lucifer, the fallen angel, would fall? I mean, isn't he all-knowing? Doesn't that go, you know, all the way back, all the way in front to the future? I mean, doesn't he know everything that will ever happen? Another thing, the whole crucifixion Jesus thing, did Jesus get up onto the cross of his own free will, or was he forced to? I read a couple of different versions, and ironically, they're all in the Bible. If he did out of his own free will, then how exactly is it that you <clears throat> justify hating his killers, or the Jews who you insist killed him, despite the fact that it was, you know, that other people who actually put him up there on the cross? And if it was done to him, then couldn't God have prevented it? Couldn't Jesus himself have prevented it, being God's son and all? If it was forced upon him, how do you make sense of the whole omnipotence thing? Couldn't God have stopped it? I suppose that's it for this one. Bye.